Instructor M. Wecky now demonstrates Kediwaza, kicking technique. The front, front kick is demonstrated first. Note how the knee rises up high, and then the leg snaps out and back. This is front kicking with the ball of the foot. Back. All right, same thing from a front view. The knee raises high and then snaps out and back. And now from a front stance, okay, the rear leg pulls forward into a chambered or ready position, knee raised high and then snaps out and back. Here it is, full speed. Now, Ueki Sensei was known as one of the premier kickers in the Shotokan style. Now, Mawashigeti, roundhouse kick. And note how the hips turn around to provide the torque or power in the technique. They chambered first, hip rotation for torque. And then the snap of the knee joint provides the actual speed of the kick. Okay, tremendous torque or power generated by that hip rotation. You can see it right there. Uh, now shifting to the other side. left side roundhouse kick striking with the ball of the foot now yokogeri kiyagi side snap kick snapping the leg straight to the side and hitting with sokuto or the edge of the foot All right, now note the chambered position for the side snap kick. The knee points out in a 45 degree angle. And right, then the kick is snapped straight out and back again. There's a subtle difference between the side snap kick and the side thrust kick. Now, side thrust kicking. Note how the supporting leg rotates out as the kick is performed. By kicking straight down. This is konsetsugeti, or joint kicking, kicking towards the knee, or the support leg of your uh, opponent. When the supporting leg rotates on this kick, it allows the hips to go into a different position and provide for more of a thrusting action during the kick. All right, now note the flexibility involved to perform these kicks properly.
kicking straight down. This is a thrust kick against lower level targets. Ushirogeti, back kick, right, kicking straight to the rear, okay, raising the knee up into a chambered position, just like the other kicks, but kicking straight back this time. Okay, the point of the heel, or kakato, is used to strike the target. Now, kicking combination, taking all the basic kicks and using them together in a combination as a training method. Front kick with the lead leg first. Front kick from the rear leg. Roundhouse kick. Side kick. And finally, the back kick. Front kick again. That concludes the, the technique. All right, here it is again, full speed this time. <laughs> 